All right, welcome back to Pokemon Diamond version. So we're going to be getting a few things here. Hi, hi, do you want a Pokemon egg? They found this at the daycare in Olaceon Town. Want to take it? There you go. This is what I heard about eggs. If you take that egg and travel with energetic Pokemon, it'll hatch. I remember someone announced that. Professor Elm of Johto, maybe? Yeah, so we can hatch this Pokemon, which may happen soon. I'm not sure. Um, but I'm just curious to see if it has a certain item. Like, I know what the Pokemon will be, um, but it can carry a certain item, or I may be able to get that item another way. Um, we can't go into the gym yet, because we have to go to the... Here we go. Oh, I'm so sorry. Please excuse me. Are you entering a contest? <laughs> Enjoy yourself, please. Incidentally, F Fantina, the Heart Home Gym Leader, also happens to be a contest expert. You may ask yourself, how do I know this? Well, I'm Fantina. You may challenge me, but not yet. You must become much stronger. Then you may challenge me. So, actually, we're not going to fight the gym here yet. We're going to... We have to wait for a couple more badges. Oh, my hero! Oh, hi, Lando. Wait, no, really? Joanna's your mom? So you might be a contest star? Oh, I don't know about that. I've never spoken to Lando about contests. I'm surprised you two know each other, though. Oh, yes, that's right. I need to thank you for earlier. Please take this accessory. I got glitter powder. <coughs> Put that accessory on your Pokemon before a contest. It will lend a nice touch of sophistication and glamour. I'm a contest judge, so come join us for a different kind of fun. If you're unsure of yourself, we also practice sessions. Okay, Joanna, I'll see you. So I don't need to do the contest. Were you surprised to see me, Lando? I got bored, so I came out to Heart Home for a little vacation. I'm just as surprised to see you here, my dear. But are you serious about entering the contest? Not dressed that way. When your Pokemon is all dressed up, you can't be dressed your usual way. Put this on for a little glamour. Oh, I got a tuxedo. Okay. I'm sure it will look good on you. After all, I chose it. Go enjoy the contest, honey. Contest will give you a different look at the many charms of Pokemon. Should be an eye-opening experience for you. Bye now. Yeah, I've I've never really enjoyed the contest, so we're not going to do it. <laughs> we'll just keep moving on. Oh, okay. Ta-da! Kept me waiting, Lando. See how much tougher you are, and I've... How much tougher you and I have gotten. Right here, right now. Hey, you're a trainer now. You're expected to be ready for a battle. No winning. No whining, no waiting. Let's get this show started. Alright. Guess we're battling our arrival. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Starly. I might have to switch. I think Goopy's still out front. Yep. Yep. Let's see. Pokemon. Let's put Zeppi out. Wow! Super effective. All right. Sending in Ponyta. Let's go back to Goopy then. Yeah, I'm hoping Goopy can maybe, like, evolve this episode. And maybe some of my other Pokemon. Because I'm already higher level than I should be for the next gym. So I'm... Just kind of leveling them up however I want to right now. Because no matter which Pokemon I use in my team right now... I'm high enough level to beat the next gym, so... It's about to use Rosalia. Yes, let's switch over to... Let's do Wingly. Wingly, you can do it. Bum, bum, bum. <coughs> All right, 
Prinplup. That's gonna be one for Zeppi. I need to heal, too. Probably. Prinplup. I love that music. <laughs> it's so cool. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Ugh, you KO'd my team again? This messed up my dream of becoming the greatest trainer ever. No, I need to get a tougher... I need to get tougher and keep winning. One day. That's it. I'm going to challenge the Veilstone Gym next. See you around, Lando. You'll be blown away how much tougher I'll be next time we meet. Alright. Where's our Pokemon Center here? There it is. Just gotta heal up real quick. And back on the bike. The fast one. Now we can move on. Because the people are out of our way. Alright, let's check our Pokemon. Goopy's still up front for now, which is fine. Let me see how much you've raised your Pokemon. Alrighty. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, these guys have baby Pokemon usually. Bonsly, perfect. Go, Goopy! The only thing is, is baby Pokemon don't give you that good of experience. But, that's alright. We don't need tons. Just enough to get him to level 30, please. <laughs> Pichu. Let's keep going, because I have... I have special attack ground types. Big mud bubble. Badoo, let's do Wingly. Yeah, excuse me. Got this like tickle in the back of my throat that won't go away. Won't go away. <sighs> I guess Badoo is a baby Pokemon, because it, it goes Badoo, and then Rosalia, and then Roserade. Good stuff, your Pokemon are in an impeccable condition. Why, thank you. Thank you very much. Let's see here. Anything? There we go. I found some honey. Uh, is there anything over... Nope. Alright, nothing hidden over there. This is probably the least amount of grass to go through over here. Uh, well, we only hit one. At least it's not like last episode where there was a move every time we would turn. Bum, 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 bum. Why did I get off my bike? Did it take me off of it when I went inside or something? Hmm, a good rod is really good, wouldn't you agree? Hmm, we're of identical minds. Hmm, take this good rod. Oh, cool. Try fishing wherever there's a body of water. Oh, incidentally, 
You need me to explain how to use the fishing rod? No. I already have the old rod, don't I? Nope. Let's put Goopy back up front. I really want Goopy to evolve for some reason. I don't know exactly why. Do you jog every morning? Well, I do. Good for you, man. Staying healthy and junk. Lepa Berry. I think there's one that restores power points. That's like really rare, but it's very like sought after. Like, if there's one berry that people actually like farm in these games, it's the one that restores power points. I'm gonna put Zeppi. Because I want Zeppi to get, like, he's probably the next one I'll get to level 30. We battle together, that's why we're tough. We're gonna crunch and munch you all up. Emma and Lil. Bonsley and Mime Jr. Oh, that's perfect, actually. We're gonna one-shot sweep this. Because Zeppi's gonna bite. Bonsley and you bite Mime Jr. Now, if this were later generations and Mime Jr. was a fairy type, that would be different. But he's not yet. <laughs> All right. Wow. There's a... Hi, hi! I'm a Pokemon! What? What is that? Oh, it's a kid dressed as a Pikachu! Okay! Cool! This might get us our level up for Goopy. Yeah! Goopy! 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 Time to evolve there, buddy! Except, now that it's used double team, it's going to be really hard to hit. Oh, well, we did it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Goopy. I'm so angry. Goopy, Goopy, yes! Goopy's evolving to a Gastrodon, which is now water and ground type, so it's immune to electric type attacks. No new moves, though, which is fine. All right. Goopy has evolved. I'm gonna put Zeppi up, because Zeppi evolves at 30 as well, I'm pretty sure. X accuracy. Now I want to evolve Zeppi. When I was jogging the other day, a wild Pokemon chased after me. I swear I ran on top of the water. I was so freaked out. Sure you did there, bud. Listen, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a battle with your Pokemon. I don't know why I cannot talk today. It's the strangest thing. Oh, another breeder. Okay. Mime Jr. Perfect. Bite! <coughs> Cleffa. We'll switch. Just because. Because <coughs> Cleffa's going to be a normal type. Because this is only Gen 4. What was it? Gen, S Gen 6? Where they added fairy type? I think it had to have been Gen 6. Yeah, because it was X and Y. Because next is black and white and black and white 2. 
and then and then X and Y, then Sun and Moon, and Sword and Shield. Which I finally played through Sword and Shield very recently, so I'm really happy. Let's learn Torment? No. Torment doesn't really do anything. Badu? Just keep Charmp out. All these breeders are ending with Badoos. Uh, that's not gonna do much. Well, ah, still did a decent amount. Uh, but Stun Spore worked. Dang it! That's alright, we'll mock Punch it. Which will take it out, and then we can heal it up after. We probably have tons of money. 42,000? And I've got a bunch of stuff to sell, too, that I just haven't, because I haven't needed to buy anything. We're doing a Pokemon challenge without even realizing it. Playing the game without entering a... Without entering a shop even once. Why did I switch them like that? Put Zeppi back up front. Nope. Oh. I guess that's what the odd keystone's for. But I think you have to do something with, like, the underground stuff to be able to do anything with that. So, I'm probably not going to. <laughs> Pick some berries. And we have our bike so we can get through areas easier without a bunch of battles. Oh, she's up there. Hi there, where are you from? What kinds of Pokemon have you got? Pokemon? Wah! Cowgirl Shelly. Bidoof. Okay. It's an interesting one. You know, it took me forever to realize that Bidoof evolves into a water-type Pokemon. Because <laughs> I never caught one, like... I knew all the jokes and stuff around Bidoof, but... I never caught one, but apparently it evolves into a water type. Okay. She's probably got five Bidoofs. All of varying stats and levels. Is that the new Magikarp trainer? It's just a Bidoof trainer in every game now. Ooh. Do I have any other status moves that I want to get rid of? Uh, I don't want to get rid of Flash, though. But Swagger is so good. Because it increases their attack, but then it confuses them. So if they hit themselves, they hit themselves for a lot. I'll get rid of Tackle for now. <clears throat> I don't know if I'll ever actually use Swagger, but it's worth it to me. Because I've never had a Pokemon that actually learned it. But I know I hate getting hit by Swagger. So, like, I would want to do that to somebody else and make them mad. Just to make it difficult for them, you know? This has got to be... No, two more. Jeez, five Bidoofs. And they've been... There was a 14, a couple 15s, a couple 16s. Maybe. How strong is the last one that she's got? Another 15. Yeah, so she had a 14, a 16, and three 15s, I think. 
if I was paying attention correctly. Fancy folks like you have fancy Pokemon too. That went by too fast, I couldn't read it. Alright, there's nothing over there. Where a departed Pokemon sleep, this is the Lost Tower. Oh, so it's like the Pokemon Tower from Gen 1. Let's go check it out. Ooh, Steel Wing. Sweet. Though the only type that I know that Steel is good against... Well, there's Poison, because it's, like, resistant to Poison. But then it's also good against Rock, I think. But that's, like, the only type I know that Steel is good against. Wah! Ghost, get away! Eat, help me, team! Ooh, Stunky. I have one of those. <laughs> I'm not a ghost, I'm a dude. <coughs> Just here to find items and such. Level up my pokes. Shallows. Keep battling. Do it. This guy's copying my team. Copycat. <laughs> Cricketoon. Wingly. in this guy. Ooh, ooh. Hey, you're no ghost. I told you I'm a dude. How's it going, dude? Oval stone. I don't know what that does. What does that do? Oh, it makes a certain species of Pokemon evolved. It's shaped like an egg. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, see, I've got Stardust. I've got a Nugget. I've got a bunch of other stuff that I could sell. My Pokemon were taken from me. Team Galactic did it. Ever since, I've never forgiven their faces. I will never forgive your face. Roughneck Kirby? Aw, oh, he's got a little Cleffa. Dude's got a little Cleffa. Big dude, little Cleffa. Item here. Ooh, revive. I need those for the Elite Four, basically. I can't explain it. Being here compels me to battle. That's the spirits of all the dead Pokemon. Pokefan Leonard. Yeah, see, Pichu and Pikachu have really bad defense, but they also have static. 
So I'm going to avoid doing physical damage to them at all costs. If I can. But Gastrodon's really the only one with not physical attacks. Everybody else is mostly physical. Mad bam. Mud bomb. Huh? What was I just doing? I don't know. I am suddenly compelled to fight you. Oh, lots of double battles up here. Okay. Just go all the way around. I need to shake off my sorrow. Please battle with me. Shake it off. Shake it off. Pokefin Rebecca. Ooh, she got a Bonesley. I can spark it because it's only rock type. It's not ground type. But it still has pretty good defense because it's a rock type. <laughs> My sorrow is deepened. Oh no, I'm sorry. I just made it worse. I'm sorry. It makes no difference where we are. If you have Pokemon with you, I reckon you ought to battle. My Pokemon is a lively one. Let me show you how much. That's a bad pun. My Pokemon's a lively one. Bell and Pa, Beth and Bob. What? Why are there like three names there? I don't understand how that works. They're like Bell. I don't know. Did they accidentally add, like, two two duos names in there or something? I don't know, but that was weird. Oh, Wingly leveled up. Cool. Because Wingly might evolve at level 30 as well. If I remember correctly. I know Stinkly is, like, level 38 or something. Bell and Pa, Beth and Bob. Yeah, it put two duos names in for that one duo. Okay, return. So if our Pokemon like us, then that means they'll learn a new move. Or the move will be stronger. I can't embarrass myself, not in front of my girlfriend. I don't want to look bad again. Not when my boyfriend is watching. Okay, have we battled these this couple before? I don't think so. Young couple, Mike and Nat. Murkrow and Midstrevis. Sweet. Easy battle. Zeppi could take this by himself. With one hand tied behind his back. Murkrows give a lot of experience, though. Because there were Murkrows in one of the routes where I was training. And they gave a lot of, a lot of experience. Uh, not a whole lot, I guess. Ooh. 
Ooh, mean look. Can we not escape now? Wingley can no longer escape. No! You cannot escape. That's alright. Aw, oh, jeez, man, that's a downer. This makes me feel hollow inside. Oh, so hollow. Okay. Ooh, do I battle these guys now? Let me make your journey out of this place less frightening. Take this. Ooh, cleanse tag. Okay. <clears throat> the cleanse tag. Let the first Pokemon in your team hold it. It will help keep wild Pokemon away so you can leave unhindered. The Lost Towers where spirits depart a Pokemon and put to rest. Oh, I got an HM. Betcha I can't use it yet, but I got one. Oh, that's strength. Okay. Well, let's do all that stuff. Um, I'll give the cleanse tag to Zeppi, so that way we'll s we won't see no hidden or er, random battles, but we'll see significantly less. And then we can also teach somebody who, who can learn strength. Oh, a bunch of us can. Um, let's do it on Zeppi. And we'll just get rid of Swagger. Because I never ended up using it, but it's still a lot better than the tackle that Zeppi used to have. We'll kind of be splitting our HMs up a little bit, you know. Because, I mean, our starter already has two, two HMs on them. But that's all right. Yeah, there aren't many battles in here anyway. So, like, we've only gotten into, what, one random battle this entire thing? Alright. So now we can just keep moving. You're not supposed to intrude on my time with Sue. Huh? You want to battle with me? I will if I can team with Ty. Alright, you guys team up. I'll beat you both. Not a big deal. Ty and Sue. Machop and Meditite. Okay. <laughs> so, Zeppi's Bite will actually be neutral against Meditite, so might just do that. And then Wing Attack is going to be super effective against Machop and probably take it out in one hit. <laughs> so maybe this will one shot because it should be neutral yep there we go see thinking strategy always the strategy going in the brain I only have eyes for Sue maybe that's why we lost I'm sorry Ty There, there's got to be like items back there or something. Oh, but you gotta. Okay. Ah, oh, I'm so bad at these. Cause see, you have to be going really fast, and then you have to turn and go up. Ooh, calcium. Let's see what we got here. Uh, base special attack. The only one that's really special attack is Goopy. So we'll raise Goopy's special attack. Oh. And we're almost done with this one. 
because we've got to be getting close to the end of this route. And once we're done with this route, I'll end the episode. But we had the Lost Tower and everything along with it, so... Just took a little while. Bibarel. That's what Bidoof evolves into, and it's a water type. Oh, we're already here. Okay. Then I'm just gonna heal up and save. Because there's not really much to do in this town, so we're probably just gonna be moving on. But we'll save all that for the next episode. And I'll make sure that there's not much to do here. Alright. So I just want to thank you guys all for watching. And I will... See you in the next one. Bye, guys. Alright, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want to subscribe, go ahead and do that right up here. And um, if you want to watch a random video from the channel, you can do that right up here. And then I'll put a link to my Discord down at the bottom here. So thank you all so much again for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!